Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Gary, your bearded woodworker. I belong to an art group in my little town here called the Waldport Arts Group. And tomorrow, the town is celebrating <clears throat> its Beachcombers Days. It's just a festival that we put on every year. And the Waldport Art Group, WAG, W-A-G, we're doing face painting for all the little kids. So we've got a little booth and stuff. And I told them I would make a little A-frame sign to put out on the sidewalk with an arrow to point to the right direction where the face paint is. So stick around and I'll show you how to make this quick little easy build of the face painting. Check it. Now that we have the legs done, and uh, I just happen to have these bolts laying around, it's going to work like this. Fold it up. So now we just need to find a couple pieces of wood to keep them together, and we're going to make it the same. sizes our panels here and our panels might I might just be able to screw on these panels um, and we'll see how rigid that is let's do that first Thank <laughs> you. 
All right, here comes the true test. Oh, it works. So see, it's a little wobbly here, but I think I'm gonna put a piece of wood. All right, so I took some of the same wood and I ripped it down to about an inch and three quarters and I cut him to size I made one longer to go on the outside of the legs and then one shorter to go on the inside for the other side I'm gonna just go ahead and flush and mount it right on top Sturdier. I also can uh, tighten these guys. That's pretty good, but I think I'll take some of that wind chime chain I have left over and put here in the middle so it doesn't spread out anymore. Hmm. Let's cut the bottom. Let's cut the bottom. So I think the easiest way to do this is to kind of keep it where I like it. I want to take a piece of scrap three quarter inch ply and lay it on the bottom. Then I'm just gonna run my pencil flat across. And that's giving me a good reference mark to cut that line and it'll lay flat. Moment of truth here. Did I make a mistake or was it good? I'm just gonna go right down the middle. Pretty slender. Carry it with you. Open it up, set it, go. Uh, you could even put, I guess, sandbags here if you needed to, but I'm not anticipating this thing going anywhere. It's pretty good. So now all I have to do is paint the sign.
So that's the completed product. So you can see that the arrow points one direction and when you go, it's pointing the same direction, which side that you look at, it's always gonna face one way. So wherever we're, we set this up, whether it be on the sidewalk or right in front of our booth, we can have the arrow pointing right towards the face painting. Um, it, it was so hectic when we were there, there was only three of us artists doing this. And this was our contribution to our little town is, is uh, the face, face painting that we do. And we asked for a little donation of one, two or $3 whatever the kids can give and most of them didn't give and that's fine we um we're a nonprofit organization and we just want to raise awareness of the arts we want to bring arts to our town and the surrounding areas and of course we're looking for money so someday we can buy sculptures we can buy these murals we can buy this artwork we can have a place to call home and stuff but it was really busy i um, didn't have any time to take any photos and I didn't have any time to do any video and my wife was there and we completely forgot to have her do that too. But she did take some of these pictures here. You can just see a couple of kids, see me working on it. And that's my son, Alex, right there with the skull and crossbones on his cheek. Uh, I, I pro that was the only skull and crossbones I did. I did do about two or three pirates, seven or eight unicorns. I did a, a Deadpool, I did the Joker, I did a full face a skull and some princesses and all that stuff. It was the first time that I've ever face painted and uh, it was pretty fun. I can't wait for us to do it again. Anyways, thanks guys for watching. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Let me know that I'm doing all right and we will see you on the next vid. Bearded Woodworker, out.